Stephen should be allowed to finish the group that he's in and that sit down and talk about it uh, and make make a decision at that particular time. I think that's what I heard on the radio. I think Jonathan Hill, who is mm. the, 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 the top man at the, the FEI, I think that's what he's suggesting at the moment. Yeah, I was, I was actually out in the FEI today talking to Jonathan Hill, and so he said mm. the plan is that Stephen Kenny will stay on until uh, the end of November when they have played yeah. their last game against the Netherlands and the friendly against New Zealand. At that mm. stage, we'll know whether there's a playoff. At the moment, it looks unlikely, but if there is, uh, they weren't giving any guarantees as to whether Stephen Kenny would stay on. No, I think, well, I think that's right. You know, finish the, the matches off and see. I mean, as a matter of fact, on the matches, uh, Nathan, against France uh, and Holland, I thought the Irish team did as well as they possibly could do against the teams they played against. Mm. You know, they weren't hammered. I mean, they had to go, but they weren't good enough. I mean, France is runners-up in the flipping World Cup. And Holland, with the, the you know the players they have at their disposal, you know the 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 their, their top players that play for Manchester City and that, uh, you know I think Ireland did as well as they could have done in in this particular match, those particular matches. I mean they weren't they weren't given a hiding, Nathan. They didn't play badly. I mean they didn't win, but playing against two of the top teams, uh, especially France away. Um, you know, I thought I thought they did a good job on the day. I thought they did a good job against Holland on the day. 